I believe we are created for greatness, not mediocrity. That we are to live our lives accordingly, striving to be agents of change as we attempt to leave this world a better place than we found. Hey, PLS family, thanks for joining me. This is Manny the Man Lopez with a brand new edition of PLS Tips with Manny. Today, I'm going to give you guys some tips on retention. Each week, I give you guys some new strategies and marketing tips on using the Power Lead system, growing your network of influence, and really just positioning you as an expert in your industry. So today is no different. Tips on retention. That is the key for success this week. And the reason why I want to talk about that is because I know one of the hardest things in affiliate marketing or network marketing is keeping your team intact, keeping your team focused. So here's some tips on stuff that I use on a daily and weekly basis to really keep my team motivated. So here's some of the stuff that I do right off the bat. The first thing is training. You have to train your team. You got to get them into a system of automation. Okay. You don't want to have your people or your team having to do the same redundant things over and over and over again. Okay. We're going to make this short and sweet because I know you want to get back to business and growing your network of influence. So the first thing you do is you got to train. Okay. Not necessarily you have to train yourself specifically. Get them on our training. Get them on Dottie's training. Get them on the weekly hangouts on Wednesdays. Get them on my training. Anything that's going to get them to really stay focused and seeing the value of what we got and what we're going to be able to do for you guys. Because it's not just about us. You know, it's not just me, 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 me. It's about how we can grow the team, how we can grow the family, how we can keep us growing as a company. And the way we do that is we got to keep people retent, re, retained, rather, <laughs> not retent, retended. No, you got to keep people retained. You got to keep people motivated and focused on what they're going to see of value. Okay. So when you want to get people on training, Set up some training for yourself. Maybe you have a couple of videos you can put together on what you've done that's been successful. Maybe you have a library of videos that gets people set up and, and acclimated. Or give them a simple ebook that you can put together, say a step by step guideline of what they need to do to get started. I know we have it in the back office, and a lot of people, they don't follow those instructions. So you have to, each person that gets on your team, give them a call, welcome them to the team. You know, I know a lot of people that, that get signups and, and leads and things like that, and they just think they're just going to sit in the back office and just grow the business automatically. That's not really the case. You see it all the time in the Facebook group. People are like, oh, I'm not getting any help from my upline. I'm not getting any help from my team. They need people there that says, hey, you can do it. If you need help, ask me. Hey, get, you know, all you need to do is be a resource. You don't have to be the one answering all the questions for them, but if you can point them in the right direction and they know they have somebody they can connect with personally, you're going to have success. Okay. It's plain and simple. So when you have somebody that just came on board, give them a call, shoot them a text, inbox them on Facebook, give them something that says, Hey guys, I'm here. I'm here to answer any questions you have. If you need a resource, let me know. A lot of times it's just, Hey, point them right to the Facebook group. Say, Hey, do you have a question? Great. The Facebook group, we've got a tons of people here that are able to answer those questions for you. There's plenty of times where I've had people join my team and then, then they go, well, how can I get in the answers? How can I do this? And they don't even know that the Facebook group is out there. So you got to let them know that, hey, we have resources for you. We have thousands and thousands of people in the Facebook group that are more than happy to offer their knowledge. Okay. So we want to make sure that people are seeing the value of what we have. And maybe make a short video. I've got a video that outlines literally every single thing that's in the system, how the features work, how they function, how they would use it. So it really gives them the ability to understand what they're getting in the system. That's another key uh, element of retention as well, is getting them to understand what is available to use in this system for their business. Okay, we have the, uh, the unlimited subdomains, unlimited domain hosting. We have unlimited landing pages and sales funnels. Um, we've got how-to videos on literally everything in the system. We've got the share code. So when they bring, when you get somebody on, that's another thing I would recommend. If you're doing anything outside of the Power Lead system, set up a complete sales funnel that includes a landing page, a second page, okay, when they opt in, uh, maybe even a third page if you have that and an email campaign and create a share code for that. Once you've created a share code, now you can come to anybody that you have a prospect with and say, hey, not only if you join my company here, I'm going to go and also connect you with our power lead team. This is what I'm using to promote my business, to generate leads. I've generated over 11,000 leads 
it, using this power lead system, and 98% of it has been unpaid traffic. So it's way for you to really grow your network, okay? Now, the way you would use the share funnels is get them, you know, into that system and then tell them, hey, if you join this power lead system, it's only, let's say, 30 bucks a month as a customer, 60 bucks, you know, 53 bucks a month as a, um, as an affiliate, you're going to have the ability to just copy and paste what I do. Okay, you put in this little share code and it's going to instantly duplicate everything that I'm doing inside of your system. All you got to do is change a couple links and you are good to go. So have that ability to just duplicate yourself. Once you make it a system of duplication, it's a lot easier for you to keep people on board because it's going to show them, hey, you just got to copy what I do. You don't have to recreate the wheel. Just literally copy and paste and you're good to go. Okay, and connect them with ways to drive traffic, whether it be solo ads, whether it be safe lists, you know, uh, swaps or whatever they call them, you know, ways that you can help them grow their network of influence, help them grow their network. That's really key as well. If you're not going to be there of a resource, they're going to just fall off after a month or two because they're going to see, well, I'm not getting what I'm paying for and it's just costing me money now. So you want to get them. You know, right off the bat, within that first month, get them a couple of sales. Once you get them a couple of sales in that first month, they're going to be a, a user for life, you know, because it's going to show them it works. There's a way to make money from this. My, you know, get them to cover that, that monthly fee. Once they cover that monthly fee, you got them on board for as long as that monthly fee is covered. So, you know, if it's profitable to them, they're going to keep it. It's just plain and simple. So let them understand how they can use it. Really get him acclimated with using the contact manager as well. The contact manager is really that secret sauce of the power lead system. It gives you the ability to track everything. You can make notes on prospects. You can rate them. You can put them in groups you know, as clients, as users, as uh, leads, as uh, people you don't want to call. You know, People are wasting your time. So it's a way for you to really filter out the right types of people so you're following up with the right types of people. Uh, another tip on retention is communication that is key okay having a line of communication there was i was at an event recently it's a big conference it was a three-day conference in san diego and um one of the things that they were mentioning is they had this um i don't know it was like a power outage company just a utility company right and they're mentioning that this company had um what was it um had an outage, right? And all of these businesses were out of power and they were losing stuff and it was going crazy. And they were out of power for weeks because of a hurricane that came through. And the next year, they had their consumer report that comes out that says, well, you know, how the ratings were and stuff like that. And they had the highest ratings ever. And you know what the difference was? Communication. Every week, every month, they were communicating with their, with their clients and letting them know, hey, this is what we got. Here's an update. We want to let you know if you have any questions, get in touch with us. Having that line of communication, and here's a great way to do it on autopilot, okay? You set up an email campaign that goes out once a week that literally kind of says the same thing. Just says, hey, just want to let you know, let you know I'm here. We've got training here. You know, copy your training links and things like that. And let me know if there's any questions you may have about growing your business, growing your team, reply to this email. Let me know. I'd be happy to help. And literally just duplicate that email, switch up a couple of verbiage here and there, and put it for like 52 weeks. So every week for a year, that email goes out. And it does on autopilot. So as soon as you get somebody on board, you add them into that, that email campaign. And now instantly every week, once a week, they're getting an email that states, hey, I'm still here. Just want to let you know if you need any help. I'm here to answer any questions. Here's the link to our training. Here's our Wednesday training. Here's our Tuesday training. Here's you know our Facebook group that connect with us. And just copy and paste that email over and over again. And this way, every single week, your team is getting hit automatically just with the same email campaign over and over again. So it gives you that ability to make sure that people on your team are seeing those updates. People on your team are getting hit with communication. You don't have to call them every week and every month. You know, your team may get big enough to where you don't have that ability to call every prospect or every lead or every client that you have in the system. But email can do it on autopilot. So that's a key I would recommend for you to do it on that end. How far are we at? We're almost at 10 minutes. Okay. I think I've taken up enough time. I just want to make this short and sweet. Give you guys some real tidbits of information on how to make yourself successful using the system. So I'll be back here next week with something new. 
Stay tuned. Come back at plstips.com and you'll be able to see all of my training. I've got some good how to's, getting started, using solo ads, you know, everything you need to be to be successful. Okay. So follow what I do, copy and paste, make it simple. It's really that easy, guys. I'll see you guys next week. And always remember, you are too blessed to be stressed. Have a great one. I believe we are created for greatness, not mediocrity. That we are to live our lives accordingly, striving to be agents of change as we attempt to leave this world a better place than we found.